I have a question. Go for Am it. Am I allowed? Okay. Uh, <laughs> I will ask your permission. You're Mr. Big Stuff. Uh, and then we'll switch to the NBA Finals. Really won't talk yeah. about I that. I want to ask you. him about Justice Winslow at some point. Well, that's too. where I'm going okay. right now. <laughs> Pardon me? Because the last time we <laughs> talked, you hated all the guys that they brought in. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, they brought in guys, you know, they brought in guys that were like, from Australia. <laughs> Who would get a guy from Australia to play for their team? Okay, now they brought in uh, his favorite guy, the guy with like 14 hyphens in his name. He's not my favorite, but I like him, <laughs> Willie Cauley Stein. And they brought in Winslow. So they brought in Stanley Johnson. Yeah. 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 So they brought in three yeah. guys that are in like that him. system. Uh, you've, you've watched all of them. Yeah. Who really has jumped out of those three? Because the others, uh, and, and let's don't dismiss. The others are number seven. There picks. were a couple other guys that came in. That, yeah, Jerry uh, and Grant, yeah. um, Decker, Booker. Decker. You know, yeah. everybody knows who Decker is because of the NCAA finals. Sure. Yeah. So who is you've just thought? Boy, I love him best of all. Uh, actually, what's <laughs> if we're just ranking them on who was, was most impressive? Devin Booker would probably be at the top of that list. Um, Jerry and Grant would be probably next. Stanley Johnson, Willie Colley Stein, uh, and then Justice Winslow. Justice Winslow, he had an interesting day today. It was, um, you, you know. You would it, think, I mean, for someone out there like me, you would have reversed that. Reversed totally. that. Right, right, exactly. <laughs> That's why the list is so weird. Um, listen, it's, it's, they're going to be drafted in yes. reverse to order. Yeah. But, but Justice Winslow's workout was. Uh, good, not great. I mean, j his jumper was his, is his biggest issue, and he showed it why. Was, yeah. <laughs> to put it, really? you know, to try yeah. to, to to put it well, mildly, it was, yeah, um, it was, was not a good uh, mid range jump. Who shot shooter. better from three point range, Justice Winslow today or Willie Cauley Stein two days it ago? It was probably a tie. Wow. Yeah. Okay. So and that, wow. and that's that's yes, not good for Justice right. Winslow. It's yeah, really it? not. And that, I mean, that's the one thing that I know wow. so many execs are really worried about. I, I'll say this: altitude and over an hour for a workout, which they really worked him out. It was one on o. Um, so uh, the, you know they brought Jared Jeffries and uh, Corsley in, and they you know so they uh, they ran drills with him. So the three point shooting was last. Yeah. Okay. So, so there's so there's going through the there evaluation of all the guys. So you, we've covered now Winslow, who will probably be drafted the highest, unless yeah. everybody else feels the same way that he yeah. can't play at sea level either. Uh, that <laughs> well, Willie Colstein could go before Winslow. Yeah, well, okay, Willie, you have at the bottom of that list of five or six guys, yep. you have him toward the bottom too, Willie mm -hmm. Colley Stein. Uh, well, I like Willie Colley Stein, I just don't think he's the kind of guy that the Nuggets, see, the, the Nuggets are looking, I, if you're going to skew uh, one side of the ball or the other, I think the Nuggets will skew offense. offensively. Yeah, yeah. Uh, not defensively. And, and well, Willie Colley Stein. He liked his offensive game. He liked his offensive game. Well, I, it's hard to tell. Uh, he, 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 he had a, a nicer shot. 1-0-0. He had, he had, he had, he had, no, wait. He had a nicer shot. He had a nicer touch than I thought he'd have for a guy who oh, was okay. about seven foot Yeah, he two. shot it really well, actually. Yeah. He, shot, uh, he shot it really well. It's just you just don't know how that goes down with hands in the face and everything Okay, else. Stanley Johnson. Stanley Johnson, Duh. I thought. Uh, yeah. From well, he, he, his, his his jumper was much better than I than any than people think. Um, one on O again, yeah. uh, but I, I think with him it's can he put the ball on the court and get to the rim? When he gets to the rim, can he finish over taller athletic guys? Uh, these things. That they couldn't see the finishing over tall athletic guys with the Nuggets, uh, but the the fact that he was able to give give him an idea of what he is handling the ball, what he is slashing to the bucket was pretty fantastic. And, and then when you stand next to the young man, he's I mean, he's 20 years old, and you're talking about six foot seven, six foot eight, 245 pounds, and this and, and it's just and it's muscle, and it's it's unbelievable to think that a little bit over like a year and a half ago he was in high school. Um, intelligent guy works hard on defense I really do like Stanley Johnson his stock dropped over the course of the over the over the course of the college season maybe he's making some of that up here um, in some of these workouts uh, okay so then we move to the top three guys that you liked yeah who aren't really considered in the top seven Devin Booker is a guy that's growing on me uh, you're talking about like a fungus uh, <laughs> <laughs> so you're so he's about a six five six six shooting guard out of Kentucky yeah. and um, more athletic. He I didn't get a lot of attention. There. No, he didn't. And, and see, you know, what he, one of the things is, and this goes for Justice Winslow as well. 
When you're on teams that the focal point is probably elsewhere, so in Kentucky the focal point was Towns and everybody else, right? Uh, Duke, the focal point was Jalil Okafor and then everybody else. And so when you have to figure out and find your way within that, it's difficult to see what your full game is. And I think Devin Booker falls in that category pretty solidly. Uh, he's way more athletic than I thought he could be. Uh, handles the ball above average, really can shoot, which we all knew he could do, which was really shooting yeah. the ball. I think he's going to be, in pretty short order, a, a, a really productive... Uh, Bradley Beal comes to mind when I when I think in terms of yeah Bradley Beal yeah yeah in terms of that kind of production out of a guy that size. This portion of the big stuff brought to you by Grand Prix Motorsports. That's your source for the original motorcycle, Indian motorcycles. So check out the newest line of Indian motorcycles at Grand Prix Motorsports on Connie Line and Santa Fe. That is Scott enjoying his cycle in his flip flops and shades and baseball cap.